Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're talking about news that has come out from the Spider-Man cast talking about Tom Holland wanting to play James Bond. I feel like I covered James Bond so many times on this channel, but it's been the talk of the news, for, talk of the entertainment industry for quite some time now. So what they've come out and said is that Tom Holland talks about James Bond and playing James Bond a lot, like a lot, a lot. And that's the quote that was given. And that's interesting to me. See, his agent has actually made a push in the last month or two to push him for that role and to get him, I guess, auditions or get him in the room uh, with the creators of the show to talk about him playing Bond in the next Bond saga. And so that's, it seems weird. It seems weird that he would kind of want to go for that role being so young. I can understand it with him being British and it being like a massive, massive role. But I don't know, it just rubs me the wrong way. I feel like if they were to go with Tom Holland for Bond, it would be a cash grab, like hands down, because the character of James Bond wouldn't be in his 20s. And while Tom Holland is mid to late 20s now, he's really, really baby-faced, and that doesn't suit the character unless they're going to do an origin story. So that's where it gets a bit kind of different to me and maybe sheds light into what they're looking to do with James Bond moving forward. See, every time they've reprised the role of James Bond, it's just been the same type of story. It starts off with him just being an agent, working for MI6, and, you know, taking down the bad guys, and that's always been the middle-aged Bond. Whereas now, maybe that's gotten cold and stale and they need to do something new. So an origin story wouldn't be bad. So I guess that's the only way I could see Tom Holland playing Bond. And while nothing has come out about it being, you know, super strong and really, really likely that he would play Bond, if his agent is pushing for it and he talks about it nonstop and he's really gunning for that role, I don't see why they would shy away from that. He's clearly a huge box office star. He's also talked about wanting to move on from Spider-Man saying that, if he's still playing Spider-Man when he's 30, he's done something wrong. He's like, what, five years away from that? So he's looking to move on pretty quick. And so that's been the talk of the industry for a while now, that he's looking to move on from Spider-Man. And I'm guessing he wants to do a big role as well. And what would be bigger than James Bond? Him playing the early stages of James Bond, coming into his own and learning and, you know, just the typical, typical origin story. So I wonder if that's where they're going to go with it because we've all been talking about, you know, the likes of Henry Cavill, Henry Golding, Idris Elba, these middle-aged men who fit the mould and fit the look of James Bond because we're just judging it off what we've seen before. But that's, who's to say they're going to repeat what we've seen before? I guess that's where it gets interesting for me. So if his agent is able to push, and that's been, you know, rumoured for quite some time that his agent has gotten in the room with a lot of people and has been talking about it, and I could definitely get the sense if he's talking about it all the time with his castmates and his friends, something's bubbling, for sure. So, I don't know. I don't know if I want to see an origin story for Bond. I feel like it could be cool, but I feel like it could also become really, really tacky if done wrong and it would be really hard to nail see i love bond i cover it all the time because i do love the character of james bond and i love all the movie industry talks around that character and who's going to play it but this worries me slightly i could end up really really loving an origin story with tom holland playing james bond or i could absolutely hate it and it could just ruin the legacy of james bond for quite some time so that's where it's just a bit different and a bit difficult to kind of understand if they're looking to go with just straight out bond no origin story tom holland would just be the wrong person to pick but if they are looking for an origin story of course, he would be perfect, like absolutely perfect. And that would be a role that he would look to have coming out of Spider-Man because that would sort of, he would have to play such a different character that it would broaden his, I guess, typecast in the industry and he wouldn't be typecast anymore. So I guess that's why he's really gunning for that role. But I do think there are still much, much, much better actors out there, like I've said before, in Henry Cavill, in Henry Golding, Maybe Idris Elba, he's still a little old, I think, to play Bond now. I think he's just getting on that tipping over the scale, so maybe he couldn't play Bond right now. He's probably a bit old, but like I've said, Henry Golding, Henry Cavill are my two 
incredible picks to play James Bond. I think they would just be amazing. And Tom Holland doesn't fit that sort of Bond and the Bond that we've seen before. But if they are going to change it and make it an origin story, Tom Holland would just be perfect. So let me know what you guys think about that, whether you want to see a Bond origin story, whether you want to see Tom Holland just play the Bond that we've seen before and just, you know, take on the role, or if you don't want to see him play Bond and you think this is a bad move. I'm super interested in hearing what you guys have to say in the comments, so please leave a comment. If you got through to the end of the video and you liked it, leave it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. Appreciate all the engagement, guys, and once again, I'll see you guys on the next video.